Hello everybody and welcome back to another Monster Hunter World video. I am Lutherian and this of course is Monster Hunter World. Today we are going to talk about an easy quest to farm for Jules and Zenny. Uh, this is the event quest, the triple threat takedown. All you really need is a bandit mantle and a really high DPS weapon. You're going to fight a couple monsters, make a boatload of cash, and let's just jump into it. Currently I'm making about 75k per run which averages around 12k zenny per minute. So to do this, really, you just need a pretty high-level weapon to come in here and murder these simple, easy monsters. You fight a great Jagras, a great Gyros, and a Dodogama. The real trick is to make sure that you're hitting two of them at the same time. I bring a charge blade, or dual blades usually, to the match because the dual blades hit really fast and they will generate a bunch of the little gems with the bandit mantle on but you can use whatever you like um, personally these are just two of my favorite weapons one helpful tip to minimize the amount of times you're hit by one of the larger monsters is to use the other one as a shield the great gyros does a paralyze so a lot of the times he will accidentally paralyze the great jagras so you can most of the time swap around to the other side of the Great Jagras and kind of use them as a buffer so you do not get hit by the Paralyze as well to so keep your DPS up and to make sure that you murder all these guys really, really quick. After killing one of the monsters, you may want to move over and go ahead and grab all the gems. Generally, if you leave them on the ground too long, they will despawn a little bit, so you are going to lose a couple no matter what, but you can most of the time pick up just almost all of them and I usually average around 25 to 35 you know just somewhere in that buffer range of items picked up from this just depending on the luck I get with either my cat grabbing one of the gyros and stunning the other gyros uh, allowing me time to pick stuff up or whatever so once you kill those uh, just move on to the dodogama if you still have your bandit mantle up you'll get a couple more items but other than that, you're going to kill him. It's going to be real easy. Uh, you can see from this run here, I actually got 25 of the small uh, 1000 zenny scales and then 4 of the 2000 zenny scales. This is pretty average, you know, there's 29 total. Um, and then you get all these other materials that you can sell on top of that, making extra money. Alright, now it's time for the moment of truth. We're going to see how much stuff we actually got from doing this quest. We got three gems, no nourishing extract this time, but this quest is actually super good to get nourishing extract, which you need for mega demon drug and mega armor skin potion. Not really something common you come by, um, because a lot of times you're going to be fighting these low level monsters, but we ended up getting 25,000 from the materials here, because we sold all that, we don't need any of it. Not so good gems, but, you know... That's par for the course sometimes. Another 14,000 zenny from the quest itself. Now we're going to go to the box and see how much we got from the items. So we started this with 683,000 zenny, and after selling all this stuff, we are going to end up with a grand total of 754,680 zenny. That is roughly 75k if I sold some of the other stuff which averages about, like I said, 11 to 12k zenny per minute. Pretty easy money. You can rinse and repeat this quest over and over again until you get your million zenny to get your achievement for having one million zenny all at one time, because it's not a cumulative thing, it's all at one time. You gotta have it or you don't. Um, but yeah, that's it guys. Uh, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, give a like, subscribe if you want, comment, whatever. See you later.